Ok, estamos de vuelta. Ya nos queda bastante poco tiempo porque después el grupo va a hacer una performance un tanto unplugged para, para atraer como la curiosidad de la gente para lo que eventualmente puede ser Def Leppard por primera vez en Latinoamérica el próximo año. ¿Tienes algo en español, chicos? Nada. ¿En español? ¿Spanish? No, 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 really. It's, it's, it's a shame, really, because we spent a long time in Spain and, and, <laughs> yeah. like, and none of us actually learned the language. Because where we were, there was a, a lot of English-speaking people anyway. Okay. So you tend to get a little lazy and, and, and speak your own language, but it's a shame that we didn't actually study a little harder to s at least try and st string some sentences together. And then even, you know, when you try a little bit, they go, oh, no, it's okay, I speak English. <laughs> okay. like, yeah, but I want to learn something, you know. So it was there nearly a year. Talking about languages and distortion of languages, slang is a, for me it's a word, it's like a distortion of language. What's the reason of the, the title of the album? I actually saw it in a bookstore. I, I saw a, a, a book called American Slang or something and it, okay. it like jumped out, it was like neon almost. And it was like, well that's a cool title. And um, I told the rest of the guys, everyone really liked it. And I, you know, I think it's kind of symbolic of rock music, you know, is, is based on slang. Any kind of uh, okay. the rap music's based on slang. Yeah. It's a very current word and uh, I was just surprised no one had used it before. But, um, so we did. Uh, and something uh, that, that called my attention was the artwork. Like, uh, the only thing that I can distinguish here is a Buddha thing, but uh, there's also like, I don't know, strange codes in the, in the fingers. What is the... I don't know. <laughs> it's not <laughs> binary <laughs> card. You know, this is like computer language, so... Uh, okay. I don't know if you can see that. Here we have it, you know, the slang thing, it goes throughout, you know, that's, uh, it's binary code, it's basically computer language. So again, it's tied in I with the slang the thing. The it's the like the mystic with the future or the mystic with the present? The yeah, I mean, that keeps popping up, we've got it on our singles, but it's also language, it's, it's, that's the, the okay. common denominator, you know, it's a slang for a computer or, or that's whatever. That is just DL for Def Leppard. It's, you know, ah. it's not very mystical, I mean, it's just... Okay. You got, oh, okay. you got the D yeah. and yeah. the L. DL. <coughs> so Def I didn't Leopard. even know that. Great. So next, next year maybe we could say 1997 is going to be the year for the flipper in Latin America for the first time. I hope so. We'd, we'd really hope no. so, yeah. yeah. You, know. to go. <coughs> you should meet like a, you should meet there and uh, uh, some uh, like friends have told you something about Latin America, about the crowds, they're very wild, right, no seats, yeah. nothing, it's just like sweating That's, and... Yeah. Uh, and we've also seen a few shows from around South America as well. There's a lot of uh, MTV Latino shows okay. as well. Like uh, we saw re recently the, the Page and Plant thing. Oh. From uh, I think that was from Rio, but uh, yeah. the the audiences just look great. I mean, that's that's the main incentive for playing anywhere is the audiences. The final question: What kind of music? Because this is an inspiration for Def Leppard to go on. Although your classics, anyway, you're thinking about like go further and reinvent yourself. What kind of music are you listening now in the 90s that oh, helps everything. you like an inspiration? Very you different name it. things. Yeah, I mean everything contemporary, <laughs> like black contemporary stuff, R&B, rap stuff, alternative, some old stuff, okay. instrumental stuff, some Indian instrumental classical music. Oh, well, there's just some Indian. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's yeah, some yeah. of that come through on there. But yeah, just everything and. Uh, I think that that makes it interesting and if you, you keep open-minded about your influences mm. and your inspiration then you'll be open-minded about your songwriting as well. There's good music in, in all types of work no matter what it is and you know there, there shouldn't be any boundaries and, and we certainly don't have boundaries on, on music that we listen to. If we like it, we like it and you know and you pick influences from it. Bueno, un buen ejemplo es que la, la gira en los Estados Unidos está siendo abierta por, no va a ser así en Latinoamérica ni en Europa, por Tripping Daisy. ¿Are you planning in Europe to have an opening act or something? Or you have an yeah, I don't know that's going to be. I know Tripping Daisy are doing the US and, and Canada and stuff. But, okay. um, it's television, actually. Is it? Is it yeah, I think television are, are playing with us. Yeah. Certainly in England and I believe in Europe as well. Okay. Thank you very much for your time. You're going to do an acoustic thing, an acoustic... Uh, we'll do our show. best. Okay. Uh, we're going to do... Uh, and what else? Uh, all I want is everything. Okay. And a couple of oldies as well. Two States Behind and Armageddon. Thank you very much, guys. It's our right. pleasure. Thank you. And take care, having. man. Thanks. And <coughs> best of luck for the future, man, because you deserve Thanks. it. And the show Thanks. was great. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Ya volvemos con Def Leppard en vivo tocando los estudios de la prima. Phil. Joe, Rick, Vivian, Rick, Jeff Leppard, thank you very much for your time. We hope we're going to see this in Latin America soon. Yeah, like so. chance of Argentina, Absolutely. Colombia, Chile.
Esto ha sido todo por la prima. Gracias a Def Leppard y nos vemos en la próxima. Chao.